Hey you guys and welcome back to another reading. Let's see what this is. Which one's I want to use? Let's do this for the overall energy. What's going on with Divine Femme, Divine Masculine, please, Daddy? Thank you very much. And also, thank you guys for y'all constant support. You guys rock. I don't think you understand. Y'all are amazing, bro. You really are. What was that? I'm hearing that song. We can get a room on the south side of the ghetto. Could we make sweet love? My finds are in there. Somebody want to do some real romantic shit. They want to do some real romantic shit right here, y'all. Oh, we got C0101. Zero, one, zero, one. Damn. Yeah, somebody, somebody, oh, look, her card out. Love again. So this definitely is about love. I'm going to see it. Moving on. Emotional loss here. Okay. Love begins. Moving on. Emotional loss. Traps in fear. We. Something is destined, fated to happen. Stand your ground is in the reverse. Uh-oh. Somebody want masculine back. Somebody want fam back. Oh, no. Y'all ain't going for it. Y'all are well aware. Crown chakra energy. Oh, y'all know. Y'all ain't going for none of this shit right here. Whatever the hell this person wants from you, you are not participating is what I want to say. You is not a footiest. It seems like this person, um, whoever you all may be dealing with, it seems like this person is genuine, but they're not. I do want to say that. Okay. I do want to say that here, family. Let me fix this. Let's check. Let's So, oh, somebody did not want that message out. They don't want me to get this message out, but I'm not about to stop my fucking reading. Fuck. So, yeah, it's like somebody is confused because something is not going the way that they wanted to because they were causing illusions here. They were. These motherfuckers be causing all kind of illusions to y'all and then be mad as fuck at you when you see right through it. Chill. Look at the storm morning. Chill. Somebody mad as hell at y'all. But they, they mostly mad at themselves. You dig a rule? These people mad at they damn stuff right here. They mad because the illusions didn't work. We, you're balanced already. You're doing things that, you know, makes you happy. Look at this shit. I cannot make this up. The magician in the mirror, part of the deck. This fog be pissing me off sometimes. Like, girl, what the fuck? This fog is, bitch. Somebody can't even they, they don't have any concentration This person doesn't have any protection Goodness gracious It don't ever gotta be like this But people be making this shit like that for themselves This happy family energy In the reverse here This woman holding a coin Yeah, This person thought See what they thought was that everything was about money And this was a, a, a person that was very vanity. This person thought everything surrounded money. They, they, Everything that had something to do with you, they were looking at you as some kind of money bag or some kind of ATM or some shit here. And that's just not what the fuck it is. Angels ain't fucking with it. This person can't communicate with you at all. Somebody's in jail. Look at them, look at them. Look, our angel down, Michael. This angel of balance here that's all tied up is straightening somebody ass out of the down energy here. So this, this person did think that something was going to come to an end with you all. They were trying to constrain your finances. They can't. Okay, I seen 444. Yeah, masculine that got the fuck on. This person was trying to definitely um. why am I picking up this genie in the lamp energy from this goddamn card? 
I don't know. It's something very magical about you all. Yeah, you're finding out that somebody is not your twin flame, that they had been lying to you. How the hell this person going to try to convince themselves that they were your twin flame when they were the one doing spell work on you? What the fuck? This ain't no goddamn twin flame. Twin flames don't need to do spell work on each other. And even if this is your actual twin flame, that don't mean this person is fucking divine. It just doesn't. You do not got to be with your twin. This person is very envious of you because you chose to walk your path. The fuck? Like I said, no communication. And I know a lot of people say you can't cut ties. You can't cut cords with your uh twin. Uh, Yes, the fuck you can, bitch. You ain't got to deal with nobody who you don't want to fucking deal with. You may have a, a tie to them for life. Like a, a bond, like y'all supposed to be twins, but you don't got to fuck with this person. You can renege on this contract at any time if you got married to. If you got a, a valid reason to not want to fuck with this person because they're doing spell work and shit, you can do what the fuck you want. At the end of the day, you're still a human fucking being and you don't got to accept shit that nobody try to fucking give you. Especially no fucking disease or some shit that's poison. The fuck? These motherfuckers right here be doing all kind of spell work and shit on y'all and trying to take advantage of the twin flame in you. These people be feeding off of y'all energy for fucking years, taking your energy, giving it to a karmic. They go out here and marry karmics and have a child with karmics. Okay, well, do that. The fuck is you talking about? You ain't got to be with nobody because you're a twin. Get the fuck out of here. Look, yin at the bottom of the deck. This is little. This is your actual twin, but this this person right here, you ain't gotta be with them. This person has done too much, and if you choose to be with your twin, that's I mean, do whatever you do. Do whatever you do. Me myself, a nigga can't ever put no magic on me, and I'm gonna fuck with you. Never. You can't ever try to ruin my life, and I'm gonna fuck with you. That's just never gonna happen. Yep. So never in this story with these kind of energies here. Somebody's about 37 years old. Somebody's about 42. You're being very flexible though here, fam. That's why. You're, it's somebody else coming. Somebody else is coming in that you can co-create a life with. And they're for you. This person is going to be all about you. Oh, we. This person is. This Whoever this is from your past, this person doesn't give a fuck about you. And they never did is what they heard. Because guess what? This person was loyal to a, uh, to a karmic. I heard telekinesis. Yep. No place like fucking home. This person is trying to disturb the peace in your home, too. Yeah. No, you ain't got to deal with this damn person. I don't like this motherfucker. Whoever the fuck they are. This twin flame burnt their fucking face card. Period. Straight up. Charbroil is what I fucking heard. Yep. It's an unfinished symphony. I heard unrequited love. This person is not poised enough to go on this path with you anyways here. You're on this treasure island, I feel. And you may have to walk this journey alone in the beginning, or you did. And that's why you're being granted a new soulmate. This person, this person right here can't come with you. They've done too much, okay, here. Yeah, magical help is on the way. A lot of you all need to get out. A lot of you all are training as well. Masculine, you got rock hard abs. You got thighs of a god. We. Damn, that booty getting plump. Y'all motherfuckers working on yourself, bro. Work, keep working on yourself. This person is going to come in towards you. I'm hearing love by uh, Music Soul Child. Okay? Do not get it twisted. This, this, uh, this person from your past is going to come in and try to create something with you only because they can't see what's truly going on. This person have been stalking the fuck out of you. They don't know what's going on. They can't spy through tarot. This person was literally like, you can have a child with this person or anything. This person was doing spell work on you and your child. This is a fucking loser. A lot of y'all are going to be very unforgiving to this energy here. We, yeah, because you let go, you detach, you move the fuck on. And that's why you're being graced to someone else because you had the inner strength to walk away from some shit that don't serve your purpose. This person was not gaining any uh, knowledge, wisdom. They were not doing anything the whole time you all were separated is what I heard. It's like you were chasing. They were running, but they were running to a karmic, running to something that was just fairy tale. Like literally, they thought that that shit was real and it wasn't. 
But see, your life is a fairy tale, but your life is real. It just seems to be fairy tale. Hence, so why this person couldn't tell the difference between a real divine feminine or a fake ass bitch? This whole can, you know, tell the difference between a real divine masculine and a karmic. You close the door on this person. And I feel like that's exactly what they get. This person and this karmic was doing spell work on you. And your kids too. You don't even have to have children with this masculine energy or this feminine. But they got kids with this karmic. And you have kids. Maybe with other people. This person is jealous of your kids. This karmic bitch be comparing their kids to yours. This bitch was trying to do magic to steal the destiny of your children and swap it with their raggedy ass kids. Yeah, bitch, get the fuck out of here. These people could be divorced now, but you don't give a fuck. You're not going to. Mm. Yeah, no, you don't care. Confirmation, my ears ringing like fuck. Thank you, spirit. Yeah, this person right here, they did a lot to you. Yep, privileged lady. Now they want to recognize who the fuck you are. They already knew, though. This person thought that they had time, but now they going to jail and they really got time. 11-11, I seen. This person going to get a lot of years. Look, say the world, another 11. You're definitely a twin. And for most of you all, you don't even know your twin flame. This was a karmic twin. This was a false twin. I heard the name Pierre. Monroe, Watson or Wiley, Wilder, Bianca, Shanice, it's my name, Terrence or Torrance. Yeah, you all are high honor. You're already on your path. I feel like everybody right now is being judged. This person don't want to be judged for something that they did very foul to you. They were trying to sacrifice you. Or the love of y'all's this connection or the twin flame connection. Because there is no love from this person. Yeah, this person's a main male, main um mature female in a um, reverse. They these these are karmics. I do want to tell you that. This is a group of losing karmics here. I feel like whoever you think is your twin is not. This person is not your twin. This person was trying to sacrifice you for great fortune. This is an old warlock ass fuck nigga or a witch ass bitch. Period. And they were taking your energy and like I said, giving it to someone else. They're false. They were not going to stop doing this. I feel like a lot of you all cut ties with these people. Literally, you stop answering the phone. You stop, you know, being available. And this person hated that. When you stop doing that, that meant that what? That this, this person and this karma could not feed off your energetic field. They were doing some low down ass shit to you. And I feel like this karmic was lying on you as well, fam. Masculine. This karmic was lying to this person about you saying that you were doing shit to them. Of course, with the help of spell work, they got this fool to believe these damn lies and illusions. And this person started doing spell work on you too or condoning it. You did the rule. That shit is not working. They're all false. In any courtroom, they deem to be false as fucking hell. Fuck. Yeah, these are a bunch of karmics. And they were doing shit in the community. 1333, as I said, that's to steal shit from you. Trying to change your life over and over. They wanted you on the streets, poor, begging. And like I said, they were doing shit to you and your children. They were trying to steal the path of your children because your children are divine. And like I said, you don't got no kids with this person. So this is a fucking karmic. Their kids are karmic, not yours. You do the rule. This person was trying very hard to try to prove a point. So, to who is what I'm saying? This person is only going to be pointing in a courtroom because they're going to snitch on someone as well. But they still going to go to jail. I heard the first group uh, be last and the last will be first. This person was taking your good-hearted nature and using um, that to their advantage. This person is a master manipulator. This is a narcissistic motherfucking fool. And this person is being left out in the cold. If y'all want to, bro, if you want to, I can't even explain how much of your energy this person stole from you. And then tried to go manifest with a karmic. These people could have literally physically stolen from you.
these people be manipulating everything because anything that's for you, your blessings, they want for themselves and their family. These are a bunch of karmic motherfuckers that want to live lavish. Bitch, you're not an empress. Ho ass ho. You're not no fucking empress, bitch. You're a loser. Any kind of bitch that do anything like this to anybody is a losing ass, low down, snake ass, slithering ass, motherfucking cunt. Period, sis. Scorpio Cancer Pisces here. What else are here, daddy? These people losing, bro. These people are carnivores. And they need a lawyer now with the four of pentacles. These motherfuckers need to seek legal counsel while they're worrying about you and stealing your energy. Somebody could literally be trying to, you know, come in and work together with you, saying that they're your twin because all they do is get, uh, get readings and shit on you. And even if this is your twin flame, they still allow a karmic to be the reason why they never came towards you, cancer energy. These are a bunch of losers. All of them are losers. All of them. And they're all stalking you. I heard this bitch even got their children trolling you. These motherfuckers might be trying to have their kids be friends with your kids, 16, 16, to try to cause some kind of ending for you all, steal from you. Mm, 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 mm. Somebody named Kayla. Princess of Pentacles. Yeah, these motherfuckers made a horrible investment coming down your way, period, with this. These are some... These, they were doing death spells on you and your kids and everything. Look, I cannot lie. Death, ten of fucking swords here. The lovers in reverse. The ace of fucking swords. True. These motherfuckers wanted you to get out of this six of wands energy here that you got to by yourself. They want to be famous. They want to be um, known or something. These people are nobodies though. Hmm. Yep, judgment will not go in their favor. So this is, you know, back to guys, you have to use your fucking discernment with people, bro. That's just all I can say. You must always be discerning because these people are going broke and they would do anything to attach themselves to you, to your lineage, to, you know, your energy field. And once a person is in your energy field, it's very hard to get them out, especially with this narcissistic piece of shit. This motherfucker is going to the slammer. They are going to prison. This motherfucker owes the devil. They owe, motherfucker, you owe. Before the fucking... Man. I don't even know what I want to say about these goddamn people in my African voice. I ain't never been that damn pissed off that I don't know what to say, man. This shit like me fucking hell for it, bro. These motherfuckers. Oh. After end. No. The answer is fucking no. We're up here for these goddamn karmies. Yeah, these are a, a bunch of karmies. <laughs> Claiming to be fucking divine. Because you're sitting in this nine of pentacles here, fam. Masculine. Y'all are sitting in a nine of pentacles by yourself. You are indeed the empress. You're coming up in the upright. Libra energy. These motherfuckers, like I said, eight of cups in reverse. They're not walking away because they want this ten of pentacles here. They're not getting shit. Nothing. What work, I mean, other than spell work, did you put in on getting the ten of pentacles is what I want to say. But we, these motherfuckers ain't never did shit. How the fuck you sit up here expecting the ten of pentacles and you ain't never did no work for it? These people think that shit's supposed to just come flying to them because they do it spells all goddamn day. What the fuck, bruh? You can't possibly be trying to make your living off of doing spell work to take shit from other people. What is it that you're accumulating? Karma. What the fuck? These people might live good for a week. Maybe not even that long. And then everything fall to shit. They always getting bad news. That's, I mean, that's just their karma. They're getting bad karma. Just getting that karma. That's just all that is here. You got the jackpot, fam. That's me. These folks mad in here. They getting readings on y'all folks. These folks study your birth chart. They try to do shit to go along with the moon cycles and shit to try to steal. 
now they're having you know issues in their home so this goes back to that energy that be arguing about divine femme or masculine in their house bitch why in the fuck is this person's name coming up in your house i need the energy no i need the energy no i need the energy we can share it what kind of fucking energy this shit here crazy. Like I said, they had on went broke. This a copycat bitch that's trying to be divine, fam, or masculine. I told you they're getting bad karma. They're getting their karma. Divine, fam, and masculine is getting good karma. They're getting bad karma, motherfuckers. And they know this. Yeah, love triangle. They wanted you to be involved in a third party. I feel like this karmic was okay with this masculine cheating. If you knew about this karmic or if you didn't, whatever the case may be, this bitch was okay with them cheating with you because they knew that they were bringing energy back. You dig a room? Everything in this, these people's life is fake as fucking hell fuck. Now their heads is in the they heads in the clouds because you're winning. You keep fucking winning. They don't know how you're still winning after all this spell where they keep on. Oh, the karmic even. Let me tell you something. This karmic bitch is mad. Because this karmic ass fuck nigga can't come in and have sex with you. Oh, she's more mad than the masculine is. This bitch needs your energy more than him. This hoe is literally crying. Everything these people do regards spell work. Anything that they try to obtain, they got to do a spell to get it or... Like, what the fuck, bro? But it's always off of someone else's good karma. They try to use the energy of being in a relationship, right? And then when it comes to divine femme or masculine and then say that, oh, okay, well, I'm going to choose the person that I'm with. That's how they offset the karma. This, Okay, so this is that same energy I picked up on before. This is that energy of a karmic ass fucking twin flame or false flame that comes in and tries to have sex with divine femme or masculine and try to start up something. And then they have to sit there and make a choice. Like, should I just be with my, I'm going to just be with my family. And then karma immediately goes in their favor kind of energy. They come to deplete you. They come to steal everything from you here. You got ghosted here. Y'all ghosted these people. Y'all posting pictures and shit. Motherfuckers is mad. 22, 22, I seen. Oh, yeah, look. As I said, that extra trigger came out. But these ain't no shooters. You dig a rule? These folks are not no goddamn shooters. They're a bunch of spiritual fucking haters. That's what that is. And see, these people be wanting y'all in fucked up predicaments because they're not able to manifest any fucking thing at all. So get what they want. You to be in a low vibration so you can't manifest anything. But you already are in this jackpot energy reflecting. Like I said, you are a master manifester here. And they're curious about you. This karmic, I'm going to tell you the vibes. This karmic gets pissed off when you don't play their games with them. All that trying to call fam at 2, 3 o'clock in the morning asking about this bullshit ass nigga. That was this person trying to stay in your energetic field and feed off of you. Because they feel like, oh, that's my man. That's my girl. You sleeping with my person. And they feel like they got, you know, justification to go and do a spell. But this person don't ever, they always lie to you. This person is a liar. And this bitch is just clout hungry. This hoe want to do everything fam does. This bitch will never have the spark. All the beauty magic and all that shit is backfiring. This person does a lot of fucking spell fucking work for them. They do. And it's like everything, every single thing that they do, it doesn't work. It will never work. And they're pissed off with this uh, masculine energy because they can't get in contact with you. This person even encourages this person to contact you. Or they may do little shit to argue with this masculine or this feminine because they know that this person gonna come running to you. Yep, you change locations as well. These people are trying to put shit outside your home or inside of your home, especially with this inside scoop card. These people be literally coming into your fucking energetic field or trying to get in your house to plant shit in your house because they be stealing your fucking energy, bro. These are a bunch of energy vampires. And you count Dracula. Y'all are not the fucking same. These people ain't counting shit. They not playing with no kind of numbers. These motherfuckers just getting time. They getting consecutive life sentences and shit. 
fuck wrong with these people. It's crazy. These people literally are, they probably are involved in some kind of coven. Um, and they also teach their kids the same thing. They got their kids projecting, you know, negative energy to me. Even if these people are broken up, this karmic bitch has brainwashed their children into making it seem like it's your fault. They got their children sending you negative energy. Because you're winning as fuck. Girl, it ain't that, girl. You got to understand when you, your children, your, everybody in your family is focused on one person that you don't even fucking know because this fuck nigga is a liar or this bitch is a liar. Girl, you are, your life is in shambles, honey. Your life is in shambles. This person's whole family know who you are, fam. Masculine. And they all been doing spell work, you know what I feel? You got people that you don't even know that's doing spell work on you. You don't even know this karmic bitch. You may be aware of this person, but that don't mean you fucking know them. Bitches get that shit real confused. Ho, you might be aware of me, bitch. You might know of me, but you don't fucking know me, ho. Stop telling people you know me, bitch. Nigga, stop telling people you fucking know me. You don't fucking know me. You don't know shit about me, bitch. No, you don't. Romans 3, 1. Yeah, like I said, change locations. Something significant about Facebook. And you might be changing like your social medias here. Look, the plot fucking fell. This nigga Jeff here. This nigga Jeffrey ass. Somebody was trying to induce sleep paralysis on you. Yeah. They want to try to tell you right here, fam. I was going to get a new phone, guys. Get a new phone. Look, this is your twin flame. Like I said, all of this shit came out at the same time. You're winning this fucking hell fuck. Okay? You are. This person is not over you and then energy vampire. I can't make it up, bro. I could never make no shit like this up. Ever. This person is not fucking over you. They don't know what to do. So could be a Taurus here. This low vibration was fucking hell too. You got an inheritance coming in. Look, you are the first millionaire in your family. You are though. What else is here for divine fam, divine masculine? Mm-hmm. This nigga James. This nigga James spell work done backfired. These people are like I said, they're checking your birth chart. They're doing all kind of shit. And Spirit said that's the truth. They're checking your birth chart and all kind of stupid shit. Trying to get information about you. They're trying to keep something hidden as well in the background. John 3 16. They want to know what your calling is, who you are to God. And they do everything in their power, which is nothing because they are powerless as fucking hell fuck. They do anything that they can to try and block you. Why you think they got so many people working against you? Because these people are powerless as fucking hell. Listen to music, meditation music, I want to say. February the 4th is significant. I heard, how would I know that? Okay. Instagram. These are a bunch of jig of damn bulls here. Mm. What else here? False fucking prophet. This fake bitch want to be a prophet. This fake nigga want to be a prophet. Look, it's a trick. Everything that they tell anybody is lies. Could be a Virgo here as well. This is happening to a Virgo. This is not a Virgo doing this. It's happening to one. You need to protect your energy here. From this false ass prophet. Yo, you about to get a long sum of money right here, fam, masculine, because you manifested that shit. This came out together. 334 could be significant. Hmm. Somebody wants you to know that they miss you. Psalms 91 through 97. Read that shit every morning, noon, and night. Anytime you get a chance. You definitely could be this celebrity status. Somebody wants your status, they want your ranking. They want to be looked at like they're you and they're not. Somebody was false flagging. Like somebody is just faking fucking hell. They just are. You are God's favorite, okay? <laughs> Goodness gracious. These are fucking enemies. You have an enemy here. This ugly bitch always got some pretty shit to say. This person be talking about you in the streets and don't even fucking know you. You the realest. We. I heard 10,000 miles up in the sky. And I got a hangers with say fly. I'm a big bitch for life. I ain't gonna let us die. I'm a 
Facebook is significant, okay? I don't I don't know about this Facebook shit. This could be somebody trying to uh, be you on Facebook or something here, fam. Y'all are definitely public figures. We. You're in the public eye, period. But your um your ex, this is man. I feel I feel like y'all done went through a lot of shit unknowingly. And you know what's so fucked up about this energy? These people was doing this shit behind the scenes, manipulating your life behind the fucking scenes. They were trying to make you lose shit. Like, literally, all this was behind the fucking scenes. And they don't. These people don't know what to do without your energy. They were trying to find even clever ways to steal your energy here. Hell, if they could, they would have had a, a person come into your life to steal it from you so that they can harness and harvest your energy. They would have had, you know, somebody following you and shit. You dig a rule? They would have had someone following you. Look, look for a sign. 3131, as I said. And I can't make this shit up. They would have literally had someone follow you to try to date you or something here. Because all they do is get readings and shit on y'all. Don't just say that right now. We... They know somebody is coming in, your actual twin, and all that shit right there. And they be trying to beat these people to the punch because they need your energy. They can't find no energy like yours. As many fucking narcissistic supplies, it's unlikely that this person will ever be able <laughs> to find any energy like yours. They just can't. Your energy is the most abundant. Oh, please. You the baddest baby, fuck them hoes, fuck them hoes, fuck them hoes. Yep, seriously, don't stop. Don't don't you stop. Don't you stop living your fucking life. Let these people do what they do, bro. That shit always come back full circle, bro. Always. What goes around comes back the fuck around. And there's opportunities here that people were trying to block for you, and that shit is literally coming right back to you. All the rumors and lies and all that shit. That shit was in vain. It was never going to work. And they were asking for help from other people. I was trying to say it's a group of these stupid ass motherfuckers that were doing this shit. It's a group of them. It's like they were passing around your energy or something. Like sharing your energy. And they're not going to be able to improve their health after this. These motherfuckers are sick. They're literally sick. If you've been feeling drained, depleted or something. And you know you haven't been, you know, having sex or anything like that. Somebody's trying to steal siphon your fucking energy. You have energy. These people don't. These motherfuckers ain't got no damn energy. Oh, that little supply that they had, that shit ran out. And they can't get no more information. They can't get shit from you. A lot of you all are very closed off. You are very closed off. And y'all are very skeptical with anyone that you meet anyway. But, um, you know, that's what, that's what someone intended for you. For you to be confused and not know how to make a decision. Or know what decision, which way to go or something like that. Because they wanted you to be confused so you can miss out on your actual person. Because they like, oh shit, if they occupy their time with someone else, how can I steal their fucking energy? Not the right time. Meditation brings answers for sure. Then I say, listen to music. Meditation, you, you need to meditate, bro. Because you're in this abundant ass energy. Bro, y'all energy is so fucking abundant and divine. Hmm. Just let go. Whatever this is, just release yourself from it. Because these people, man, they, they know exactly what they be doing. These people know exactly what they're doing. And they have run out of time. And they're worried. They're not ready for this karma. They're not ready for this shit. Look, no need to worry. That shit is in the fucking reverse. They do have a need to worry. And they ain't going to see the shit coming is what I'm saying. Because they... These, these kind of energies be setting up shit for y'all to just suddenly fall down. Or, you know, if something was going okay one minute, they want shit to change, like, rapidly, like, damn, it seems like every time you turn around, something is happening or ending. Yeah, that's how they wanted that shit to be in your life. 
they were sending a whole lot of low vibration to you all. But I'm telling you, it's an energy here that these people, they cannot, man, these people cannot recoup from whatever this is. They can't. Whatever, whatever these people had done to you, bro, they should have, they should have left you out of. I feel, yes, it's what Spirit said. They should have left you out of whatever this stupid ass shit was. This is all about trying to be abundant off of your energetic field. They want to have some kind of, um, I want to say relationship with you because who anything that's pretty much yours is if anything you you are the abundance wherever you are and whoever you're with that shit radiates through everyone you dig a room that's why a lot of y'all be called to cut a lot of people out bro because they only be solely around you to benefit and that's just the truth right here fam masculine y'all already know this shit though they only be solely around to fucking benefit they keep getting people together to try to stalk you and, and all this stupid shit, bro. These are a bunch of spiritual fucking rapists as well. It's like they try to force themselves into your energy too. They be trying to conjure up all kind of shit to get a connection to you. They can't. Remain positive though, fair masculine, because I'm telling you, it's about to be a sudden change here, especially in your finances. And in your love life, these people were doing shit to block any lovers from coming into you. Like they were, they were literally blocking people, and it was mostly this karmic ass fucking uh, twin. Yep, Spirit said no. Don't take no action towards this person. You don't need to do shit. You don't need to do anything. Just watch how all of this unfold, bro. Because it's just something that's not right with this energy. The situation will not fucking improve. It won't. Mm -hmm. It just won't. Yep. Forget these people. Spirit said yes to whatever you're thinking. Yes. What was that? That hell. Yeah. It's unlikely. It's un bro. It's unlikely. Like I said, these people will never in their life reach your energetic field ever. Guess what they gotta do now? live with themselves <laughs> guess what these people got to do now either find another energetic supply these people will have to get a thousand people to you know they they have to literally put together a thousand divine beings to get one energetic pool like yours you have this very healing energy. Everybody is not a healer. <laughs> Everybody don't got that healing fucking component to them. You dig a root? That's just not how it goes. Everybody is not a healer. They're just not. Like some of y'all literally are healers. Like white light energy. I'm getting Leo from charmed energy. Motherfuckers definitely can goddamn uh teleported shit right here is what I want to say. We. And they can't find, you know, Spirit said that, yes. Hell yeah, motherfuckers can teleport in this bitch. And you are not meant to be with everybody. You have one divine counterpart. A lot of y'all wonder why you're single as well. You have a divine counterpart. That's why. Oh, your person is single too. Don't get it twisted. They're not just out here fucking and shit. Anything that you're doing, y'all are mirroring each other. And you all will, you know, come together in perfect alignment. This person is going to communicate something very clearly to you that they know who the fuck you are and all that good shit right there. This person is not going to try to come in and use you for your energy. This person has their own divine energy. This, this masculine or this feminine can manifest on their fucking own, but they can be trusted. This fucking karmic ex of yours can't. And I don't give a fucking hell damn fuck who they are. What just fell? Yeah, in the near future, this person is coming in quickly, too. I feel like you're just going to meet this person by chance. I've been picking that energy up, too. You're just literally going to meet them out somewhere. You're not going to be planning to meet this person. It's going to be when you both are in alignment with each other. You dig it, Ruth? Y'all are both in alignment, and there is nothing better than this person. This is your divine counterpart. You guys are made perfect for each other. This person gonna tell you they're gonna give they gonna tell you something very shocking. But it seems like I said you're gonna meet this person, right? 
it's divinely guided because they know who you are is what I'm saying. Like, they already know who you are. This person could have literally been like, damn. A lot of y'all can think about somebody and you'll see them or they'll call you. You dig a room? There's something like this. This motherfucker gonna be thinking about you and they literally gonna see you somewhere. And they gonna let you know, like, wow, I was planning on, I was planning on coming in like this was like, you right here right now kind of energy like what look yes yes this person this shit gonna be so beautiful bro and make sure y'all let me know make sure y'all let me what am I, I want my damn invitation to the baby shower and the wedding and shit bro because i'm telling you that's exactly how they gonna happen y'all folks gonna need by chance but this person 40 40 they know who you is already they already know who you are this person already knows what to do. This person already knows. That's why you have to be able to communicate clearly with God. Bro. You have to know God's voice. You got a lot of people that are trying to stop you and block you. They're trying to block these twin flame unions, you all. I'm trying to tell you the vibes. You got a lot of fakes coming in. Acting like they fake fucking support you and shit. You have to be very vigilant at this time is what I do want to say. Okay, fam? That's fine. But other than that, I like it. Um, it. Whatever it is that you're wanting to do, bro, just keep working on yourself. All this shit is going to come to you. You don't got to go looking for shit divine. It's going to come to you. Some people take advantage of and some people do shit to their advantage. You dig guru? That's just how I feel about it, guys. Remember, God loves you and so do I.